So we're here at the, at the gym and with a renowned uh, trainer, Coach Schaefer. Say, hi Coach. Hey, hey, how you doing, man? Now this, this shout out actually goes to uh, John Johnson, Coach John Johnson with Buster Douglas up in Columbus. John, bet you didn't know that I was going to meet this guy. <laughs> so we were just together the other day up in Morgantown and, and uh, so uh, Coach over here said, hey, I, you know, I've worked with John Johnson. I'm like, you're kidding. Yeah, yeah. Uh, back, back with Alexander Zolkin. Yeah. Alexander with Zolkin and stuff and I told him about Junior Smith. Good to see you back there and back on uh, doing things uh, busy again with a good heavyweight again. Yeah, so hey, can you tell us a little bit about your uh, center here? Uh, well, right now this is a kind of our, our temporary center. Right. Uh, we're in the process of building brand new 1,900 square feet with uh, indoor track, indoor field, three boxing rings. Uh, we do uh, NFL, Major League Baseball, we do major uh, the N uh, NBA guys, uh, we do professional fighters obviously, and sure. uh, uh, quite a few different Olympians. Uh, most famous I'm known for is of course Apollo. Apollo Ono. Oh, Apollo Ono. Right. Uh, and have you have been Louis with him Vito. for 12 years? Apollo about 12 years, right. yeah. And then uh, you guys just said you have Louis, Louis Vito. We have Louis Vito, uh, uh, Shawnee Davis. Wow. Uh, on and on and on. We have quite a list of people that we, we work with. Gideon Massey right. who is a 16 time national sprint cyclist champion. Wow. Mark Freda who is uh, one of the best triathletes in the, in the world. Uh, and on and on and on. Great, great. Now uh, you've had, you've been in this location for just a little bit, right? We've been here for about three years. We've been, we've been waiting for the right opportunity to put the center together we want. We're going to be, we're doing about a uh, about a million and a half dollar project. It's not huge, but it's going to be very elite. Our focus is going to be on the elite of the elite athletes. Right. Uh, we're going to do some mainstream audience stuff, but uh, primarily we're going to do all uh, elite athletes uh, from a professional world, uh, NBA, NFL, you know, Major League Baseball, and so on. So th tell us Olympians. a little bit about yourself. You were um, you were in uh, kickboxing back uh, several, back, several back, decades ago, right? Way back when it was hard, but it was easier because the guys weren't in as good a shape as they are today. Right. But I was a world champion there, and I was a world champion in lifting and powerlifting. Wow. Set a few world records. Uh, been I've done just about a little bit of everything. Um, uh, best known for for training athletes now. You know, I'm 60 years old, so you don't look it. So my athletic days are, are gone gone by me. A uh, little you, bit. you look good though. I uh, appreciate that. <laughs> appreciate that. So, well, what, what would you like to tell some people about uh, about uh, what you're doing here, or uh, you know, how they can? Uh, well, we got some great fighters. You know, we uh, we got uh, probably three world title fights. Uh, coming up, David Estrada coming up, um, Angel Torres and uh, Carl Davis, uh, 147, 154 in a cruiserweight, and we also have a Tito Brasario who's an undefeated uh, 140 wow. pounder wow. that uh, should be in a world title fight in the next four fights or so. So we're, we're kind of doing the elite of the elite. Uh, we're not really bringing anybody up through the ranks, it's usually guys that are like my NFL guys, we do uh, a number of NFL guys from around the league. Uh, we got uh, Sly right now, the linebacker from the Steelers, played in the Super Bowl. Robert Johnson Rojo from the Titans. Uh, I worked with uh, Lisa McCoy, the running back from the Eagles, wow. since he was in about ninth grade and on and on. Uh, so the, the whole thing we're doing is, is a very upper pro level. We're going to have housing. We, we cook the meals, we do everything, all they do is come in, stay in the facility and get our job done, what we need to do, you know. Okay. Well, thank you so much, Coach, and we appreciate you letting us uh, stop out at your facility here. Oh. Um, uh, we feel very blessed that you even let us look inside the, uh, the inner sanctum here. <laughs> so I so, uh, appreciate all you do, and uh, we wish you the best of luck. Hey, my pleasure, and what a great cause, man. It's my pleasure to wear the shirt and my privilege, so well, thank you. Thank you so much. Okay. Yeah. Hey, guys, take care and continue uh, supporting so we can uh, end this uh, terrible crime against women and children. Thank you. Bye-bye. Nice.